Hello chums, and welcome to another Raid Shadow Legends video with your old bean, the real deal. Unfortunately, I cocked it up again. So, this video is going to be a two times void pull shard video. Um, basically, yes, I didn't do a good job. I was very tired, and I was very disappointed with the quality of the video. So using some editing magic, I will be projecting myself over myself. Unfortunately, you will still see my big head in the background. Anyway, I'm going to be pulling two times void. And I'm going to show you my most wanted champion. Can you guess who it is? Can you? It's a skinwalker. Leores. Oh. Everybody wants this pussy cat. Look at him. Magnificent stallion. He's beautiful. Probably the most beautiful champion in the game. I mean, I just love his fur. He's beautiful. He would look good mounted on my wall. Anyway, what does he do? What does he do? I hear you scream. He has a passive. He becomes unkillable. And he does more damage for the less HP he has. Um, remarkable. Awesome roar. <laughs> um, if you want, you can build him to throw out true fears and weakens. He also attacks all enemies two times. And he's also immune to a lot of CC. Stun, freeze, sleep, provoke, fear, true fear. That word. He's immune to it all. Apart from, disclaimer, apart from a few things, but we'll worry about that another time. And then his A1 does something else. But yes, he smacks like a mother trucker, and he is basically Skull Crown on steroids. So, without further ado, let's pull some bloody shards. Okay, so we have 124 bloody voids to get through. Let's get something okay, good, lads. Uh, small disclaimer. Um, when I originally shot this video, I was very, oh, very tired. let's also mute myself. Oh my god, look at me waffle on. Okay. What are we gonna get? Something good, I hope. Doom Screech is actually useful. I highly recommend him. Madam Ceres, she is wicked sick. She will strip buffs and place decrease attack and AoE defense down. She also can fear the enemy and remove their buffs, but it's RNG based. Not as good, but it's not bloody bad either. Oh my god! Oh my god. Constantine the Dayborn. He pairs up with Vladimir. And, uh... He doesn't seem to be rated so highly, so... He probably isn't that good, but... I don't know. Will I level him up? Probably not. But... You never know in this day and age. Let's just pray he gets a buff. In the future. Ah... <sighs> Okay, hype train, let's get some bloody gold, come on. Don't do me like that raid. Come on, I need something good. Beloa, he's a bloody good champion. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, to Hanarak. Oh, my Egyptian queen. She is very good. I'm very pleased with that pull. She has a, an A1 that puts slow on the enemies and puts a continuous heal on an ally. Um, she also, I, I believe it's her A2, um, decrease attack and block debuffs. And then she spreads it across the enemies. So she's very good for Hydra. Her passive, um, it's a bit like Doom Priest. It removes debuffs. 
but if they have a continuous heal on them, she will remove both. Ooh, Skull Crown and Shamuel. Um, this is my third Shamuel. I'm going to be leveling him out for the Hydra. He has an absolute carry for that and a top bloke. Okay, Paragon, not bad. He's, ooh, Gara Longblade. I've not actually used her, but I have her. She's meant to be very good. She meant, she is meant to smack. She is a sexy nuka, my red-headed friend. Nothing there. Okay, let's make some space. Twenty four shards to go. Wish me luck, boys. Oh, my God, I'm waffling on again. Okay, now let's pull. I, I really want a Eurogrim. Um, I'm sure everyone else does. That would be an excellent addition to my account. Another Lego would be nice as well, but I don't see it happening. But during dark times, we must remain faithful. Okay. It's not looking good. Oh! That's my full Shamuel. Do you know what? He's so bloody good. I will probably level him up as well. It doesn't hurt to have four. And perhaps, just perhaps, I can maybe make a double Shamuel team for the Hydra. That could be pretty interesting. Okay, so now I will have a look at the champions that I've pulled. Let's... I'm going to have to edit this. Jeeves! Fetch me my shotgun. Okay, so let's have a look at who we pulled. Yep, he is Sacred Order, Constantine. Um, yes. I don't know if I'm even going to bother looking at him because he doesn't seem to be the greatest. I mean, look at this. Twos across the board, and one three. Everybody dislikes this person, and so do I. No, just no, we won't even bother. But let's have a look at Tuhanarak, my sexy Egyptian queen. Oh, I mean, she's a beautiful woman, and she does like to show a bit of arse and legs. No boobage going on, unfortunately. Um, yes, she, I mean, she's quite attractive, but I'm disappointed with her clothes. I just feel that they could have made her maybe look a bit more colourful. I don't know, she's very bland. She's just like sort of two tones. I mean, normally Raid do a very good job at uh, the, the skins on their champion, but this one I feel is a little lacklustre. And, you know, one thing I prefer about their female champions is that a lot of the other champions... They show a little, a lot more flesh. She's co too covered up for my liking. This displeases me. So, I'm just going to quickly go through her abilities again. See if I was right about what I was saying. Yes, I was correct. She does do a decreased speed and continues heal on her A1. Decrease attack and AoE. Well, no, sorry, block buffs. But then it becomes an AoE because she spread those two debuffs across the board. She also has a increased defense and increased speed buff, which is bloody excellent. Two turns for her allies on a three turn cooldown. Fantastic. And as I said previously, her passive removes one debuff from an ally at each turn and removes two random debuffs from an ally if they're uncontinuous heal. She pairs up excellent with the Mitha, the the Void Dwarf, um, she's short, she's blue, and she's quite new. So, that's a good pairing. And, my goodness, not only does she do all of that, but she has an increased aura of accuracy by 70% in all allies. I mean, in all battles. 
What a bloody good champion. That concludes the end of this video. I hope you've had a bloody good time. Please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. And if you wouldn't mind, please, please tap that subscribe for further and um, for more updates and more content. Thank you very much. Take care for now. Much love. Your favorite real deal. Goodbye. Goodbye, everyone. Take care.